Hello and welcome to Monero TV. You are watching our intermediate series of videos and this episode is on simultaneous death in a loss of support claim. A judgment was made in the Road Accident Fund versus Monani case relating to the loss of support when a dependent died as a result of the same accident as the deceased. The conclusion was that the dependent's hypothetical share of the loss of support is to be distributed amongst the surviving dependents. We believe that applying the Minani case law when considering the simultaneous death of both parents is inappropriate, as the judgment specifically refers to the cases where a parent and a child died. Let's look at how this is applied when both parents die in the same accident. In this example, we will have a father, a mother, and one child. Suppose each parent earns 10,000 Rand and gets two shares of the family income, while the child gets one. Therefore, the child should get one-fifth of the family income of 20,000 Rand. If the case law is applied to this scenario, the child will get one-third of 10,000 Rand from the father, plus another third of 10,000 Rand from the mother. Our argument is that it does not put the child in the same financial position as before the accident and overstates the child's loss, as he now would get one-third of 20,000 Rand. If one parent was the breadwinner and both parents pass away as a result of the same accident, then we will compile one report but include the breadwinner as the deceased and the parent that isn't earning as the plaintiff. This will ensure that both parents' shares are taken into account. In order to account for the fact that the plaintiff also passed away, we ensure that their chance of survival will be reduced from the date of accident. If both parents were breadwinners, we consider two calculations. For example, if we first calculate loss with the father as the deceased, we will include the mother in the calculation as a hypothetical plaintiff, but exclude any income she may have earned. We will then also make sure that the plaintiff's chance of survival reduces from the date of the accident as it would have with the deceased. We perform the same calculations on behalf of the mother as the deceased. We hope that this episode has helped understand what happens in the event of simultaneous death in a loss of support matter. For more information, check out our other videos.